Hello? Hello? Okay. Hello! Hello, my dearest worm burgers! Hi! Oh my gosh. The, the second stream for the for the day. I did play Mario earlier. Let's just get the, the, the elephant out of the room. Get it? Because Mario wonder? But hello! I figured a great day. Yes, my worm burgers. Did I say singular worm burger? Oh, you you said Wormbergs. No, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. But, but hello, my Wormbergers. I figured a nice way to wind down the day would be to finish up our summer in Maneko's Night Market because we did play most of it yesterday and I promised that I was going to finish it today. So here I am finishing it. <laughs> I'm really excited to get to the fall, but I just I'm just excited for it all. So I think we should just dive in. And then, yeah. No shovel hate today? No, 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 no. I'm a shovel lover. I feel so bad. I was sneezing, guys. I was sneezing. I didn't mean to hate on the shovel, I swear. But hello, everybody. Oh my gosh. Hello. I was here last stream. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Thank you for, for trekking through all of this, the streams that I've been doing today trying to get a lot of stuff done and also it's like can nintendo chill out and stop releasing so many good games and then also like can all of these fantastic indie developers chill out and stop releasing such good games like what what is a gal to do i don't know oh and oh my gosh morgan welcome welcome to if you haven't been to to the streams before either the maneko streams or i don't know any of the other streams then welcome you are very welcome. Oh, we're going to start off today by giving a chocolate box to good old Emmy. <laughs> this is a beauty. Our viewers are going to go nuts for the footage we're going to get with this. Oh, yeah. She's like a food vlogger. And now she wants like the most expensive beef in the world. Okay, fantastic. Oh, my gosh. I'm so excited. I feel like it's a nice way to just this game is so cozy it just makes me happy to wind down the day playing some maneko you know <laughs> it's a good good time and coffee cave hello thank you for being here and happy early birthday oh my gosh of course of course i will say happy birthday happy early birthday i'm so excited to be playing this and thank you for being here oh my gosh I feel so annoying whenever I stream like twice in one day. I'm like, everybody probably thinks that I'm like the most annoying person ever. Like, Charlie, stop streaming. One of these days, you got to get us a schedule. I know. I need to be more like I need I need the schedule for sure. I feel like I do. But it's just like I like to stream when the moment strikes because I don't know. I get so anxious about like streaming and doing stuff but then if i just like surprise myself even then it's like i don't even have time to be anxious you know <laughs> i don't even have time my stream starts in 10 minutes i can't be anxious you know wait the rice ball on a stick goes kind of nutty did you see that that restores like one and a half hearts what on earth maybe i shouldn't have donated that <laughs> Whoa, that was so good. That was the first food I've ever seen that's not half a heart. Okay, I think we donated every every food we've gotten. Oh, goodness. Never annoying? I'm, I'm glad to hear it. I feel annoying. I'm like, hey guys, another announcement. <laughs> Guess who's streaming? It's your gal, Charlie, again. <laughs> oh, goodness. Don't think Charlie could make a schedule if she tried. There's too much whimsy in her soul. That's a great way of saying that um, I have crippling anxiety. I have, I just have too much whimsy in my soul, you know? Oh my gosh. Yeah. No, there's... It's... it's. I want to go where it takes me. Sorry. Plush teapot, man. I had to read that three whole times because I wasn't sure. But yeah. If you haven't watched any of the other Maneko stuff. Basically, it's a very lovely little game where there's cats and they're cute and there's crafting and there's villagers and there's a lot of stuff that is very good and fun. But okay. <gasps> and they have boximal blind boxes. So he wants a moody virtual pet at person. Okay, okay. So also, there's this thing 
in the game called boximal like you can see i have a very serious problem but there's boximal blind boxes and it's like a little gotcha thing please be a catfish we're looking for a catfish one that's just a regular cat oh that's 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 just too much <sighs> okay well we still that's granny fanny we love granny fanny in in here except that time that she told us that we ruined the town and that we suck but we're kind of over it at this point so i think we should make the other lantern that granny fanny needs for her house and then we should try and get there was a last time there was a villager that we were trying to get to move here and uh they were like oh you have to collect cogs because i make a i made a machine and in, in my fix my machine i don't know there's a whole thing so we have to like go around all the locations that we have and try to find different uh i don't have any mulberry branches <laughs> no but yeah we have to like collect the cogs and get as many i think it's five and then once we get those it's like a trash collecting machine or something it's, it's very interesting it seems like the way of the future so happy to be involved in such a great thing <laughs> yeah granny was quite aggressive it was honestly a little upsetting for me and all of us actually so yeah we need to keep our eyes healed if you see anything that resembles like a mechanical cog type of thing you gotta let me know because we need those <laughs> oh but yes I love this game it is so freaking cozy and I'm really excited to like see what happens I was literally I'm not even kidding you I was in GameStop today getting I was buying Super Mario Bros Wonder because I was like oh boy I'm gonna play this on stream today and it's gonna be amazing and then as I was standing in line waiting to buy it there was a commercial for Maneko's Night Market and I was like no way it's Maneko I love it it was so exciting for me <laughs> Oh, goodness. This is so... This is so... I just love this game. It just calms my soul. But yeah, I hope you've all been well. In the, in the, the like, hour or two that we haven't spoken if you were in the last stream as well. Or in the past day. But yeah, I'm excited. Let's get some stuff done. I think a good start is getting Granny Fanny's lanterns made and i'm i'm honestly not seeing any like little cogs or mechanical parts so that's a bit disappointing i must say <laughs> how many mon maneko months are you planning to do i'm planning on playing a whole year um at least for like a video i want to do a video on like my first year and then probably i don't know if if, if you guys want to play more maneko or if there's a lot of stuff to get done and stuff then, then who knows where the wind will take us you know but i really like this game i would not be opposed to playing more it's so easy to like oh just get sucked into it like you, then you just start looking forward to like the next night market and then before you know it it's been like six hours and you're like oh my bad <laughs> at least maybe that's me um this cat Oh, thank goodness. I was like, uh-oh, we may have lost this branch. Baby doo doo. Do you stream anywhere else like Twitch? I don't stream. I only do streams on YouTube. And yeah, like we've <laughs> prefaced the stream by saying, I, re I don't really have a schedule. I just kind of go like uh, whenever the, the urge strikes. So usually I like send out a notification in Discord. And I try to be punctual about it, but then other times I'm like, hey guys, streaming in 10 minutes. <laughs> so, <laughs> you know, that's probably the best way to be up to date on it. But I don't know. I know that some people have been moving to stream on Twitch instead, and I kind of don't understand it. I'm like, am I missing something? Should I be? I don't know. I have no idea. I'm just so used to YouTube anyway, so I don't know. <laughs> but... I made washi paper using the branches that we just got, and now we're able to make a beautiful lantern. Oh, with our, la our, our our paper crafting bench. Is it four? Oh, just three. Beautiful. 
and okay we've got today is sunday so we have a whole week yeah this is the gear that we need it's a machine part i'm gonna be real i didn't see any in the orchard so i'm feeling like maybe that's not the place but i think i'm gonna go buy another um tool from hank so that we can unlock a new area because I'm thinking, we, we first of all, there's a missing child that we need to find. Miyako, who's like our rival, kind of. And then also, it's just fun to go to new places. Um, I think I'm going to get the smelter. Because I think that this unlocks, like, yeah, the metal cave. Go mine some metal rocks out there and you can melt them down into metal ingots with the smelter. And if you coincidentally manage to help us reclaim our village from the agents in the process, all the better. I love it. All right. Oh, Hank just said they weren't always like this. What did the agents used to be like? At first, they were brought in to keep this place safe when sightings of Nico began to crop up. It'd say, oh, around a year or so before you arrived on the island. Around the time people started reporting Nico sightings. No one was quite sure how legit the claims were or what the real explanation behind the sightings was. Surely, most of it was just mass hysteria, but many claimed to have seen Nico and were 100% insistent on it. You know, I just don't. I, I've never seen that cat before in my life. It's not hiding in my shed, I swear. Let's see. Most of the people here moved on mentally and some physically as a few folks just packed up and left. Hmm. And the agents are here protecting us still. But you know what? After your accident when you first arrived and now a second girl goes missing. Not to mention they're not even allowing the rest of us to help look for her. I know these lunkheads are causing much more harm than helping. These agents are bad news. I know it. Do what you must out there. But just stay safe, little dude. Mm-hmm. Hank knows what's up. Hank the hunk has got a, a hunky brain on him, you know? Oh, boy. And, oh, yeah. Um, wait, let me see. Somebody had mentioned... I don't I don't even see it anymore. But somebody had men asked, like, if I was going to be doing more Story of Seasons streams. I am. I'm just very bad at managing my time and my excitement about new games. <laughs> so I get swept up in different stuff. And then people are like, when are you going to play Tears of the Kingdom again? And I'm like, believe me, that is all I want to do. But I, there's seven, seven new games coming out like every day. Okay, we're going to send Nico off to get some resources. It's, it's the whimsy, you see. That's very, yes, that's very accurate unfortunately okay so we have oh wait we still have to we have like a boximal that's a bowl cut boximal and there was somebody who wanted that let's see if we can find that little that little child i was gonna say little bugger and then i was like that feels a little weird <laughs> that feels like something you call your own kid and they're obviously not my kid <gasps> it's ruby Today's item of the day is the chef's hat. I've been, I've had it impressed upon me how important getting the like items from Ruby is because they're very rare to pop up. So I feel like I should get a chef's hat, but I, I, I'm going to say no thank you. I'm going to say no thank you. I've been told that the signed baseball and the lab coat are the ones I should never pass up on. And seeing as I, I, said no to a, a lab coat yesterday that's kind of my biggest priority so you want a cat purse you want something i don't know i don't see the person who wanted oh this is not great all right i think we should probably i'm trying to think if there's anything else we can do uh, let's go to a different location and look for some of the metal gears maybe if we go to the gardens i don't know What's the goal of this stream? The goal of this stream is to finish the month and yeah, because we're like in the summer. We only have like a week left of summer and we're kind of just working on a bunch of different projects all at the same time. We have like, uh, we're trying to move other people into the village from different areas. And then we're also trying to develop the night market and ooh, Ramune, can I have that? <gasps> I got a bottle yeah and we're trying to like restore the night market and also trying to like sell a bunch of Ooh, look a machine part Ooh, that's so good 
but yeah we're trying to be a successful businesswoman all around <laughs> charlie chaos barley rarely has goals in stream it's just the whimsy you know my one goal is to get a lot done before the end of the month <laughs> you know how it is i think that's the funny thing is when i like post videos i like try to have very concrete goals that are very well thought out and like execute them throughout the video but then when i stream i'm just like oh hi guys so let's do the thing yeah <laughs> and that's that's kind of it but I do have, like, with some games, like with Mineko, I don't want to have, like, know what's going to happen. I just want to experience it. Experience the magic, you know? Okay, let's go home. We got another machine part. Charlie shares the name with a racehorse. Oh my gosh, that's actually funny you mentioned that. Because I realized that at one point. Um, How do you adopt cats? I don't understand how you got the cat last stream. We didn't adopt it. We grew it from a seed. You buy the seed from the creepy magic bean lady that we that was we were talking to earlier, and then you can grow a cat. It makes very little sense, but you just you just got to smile and wave kind of, <laughs> you know. See, look, this is a, this is this seed, this crop we're growing. This is a cat in the making. So, you'll see. What was I even saying? Oh yeah, the racehorse. I was so excited about it when I figured that out and I was like, whoa, maybe I can like, I don't know, buy my own racehorse namesake or like bet on it or something. And then I realized that it died and I was like, oh, well, that's no good. <laughs> okay, so we gave the boximal to Hannah. Now she wants a boy's bracelet, which we have to have the gem crafting bench to do uh so that that really is a cheeser but okay i think we should keep i think we should check out the metal cave honestly because we just unlocked this area by buying the smelter so i think we should go oh yeah and we have to clear the agents out too oh this is a pretty area the art is just like wow so so captivating you think Miyako could have gotten lost in the metal cave? Better be careful, Nico. Who knows what's in there? Not I. Hmm. Okay. I don't see any machine parts. What the heck is going on here? I have literally no clue. Hmm. Can't go this way. Uh-oh. I think I hear some agents to the east. This is no good. Better check out what the agents are doing in the eastern side and you see if there's a way to turn the laser barrier off. Oh, okay. So we're doing like the, the double team action again. I like it. I like it. Uh. Way. So I'm pretty sure that those lights will alert the agents. So we should not do that. <laughs> we got to turn them off here. And then carefully, very carefully go. And yeah, basically our goal now is to free all the cats and clear the agents out of the area. So there's one cat freed of seven. Maybe if we wait long enough, ev everyone will forget that Miyako's gone. To be fair, there's a very, very hilarious bug that... Ooh. Oh, well, there we go. Cat two. There's a very hilarious bug that makes it so Miyako doesn't even leave. <laughs> like, literally, she just shows up in town and you're like, oh, she's fine. What's everyone making a fuss about? She was like... I don't know who did that. That was, that was disgraceful. But yeah, she was literally, like, participating in the night market events. Like, she's fine. She's fine. Granny Fanny is just making a whole fuss out of nothing. E, release the cat. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What's going on? Uh-oh. Oh. Can the agents not see over the walls? Of course they can't. Look at them. They're paid like minimum wage probably. They don't they don't get paid enough to bother. 
And also, they're not very good at their jobs. Like, look at this guy. He's just asleep. That's okay, because it means I can release that cat. I think these, like, stealth levels are so fun. I'm zipping. And there we go. We freed all the cats. Now we have to get all the way back, though, which is kind of not fantastic. <laughs> but all the agents have cleared out, which is good. Do, 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 do. New fan and love watching you play anything, but when do we get more Tears of the Kingdom? Oh my gosh! Thank you, Michelle. Thank you. Welcome to the, to the Sprigdom. But yeah, um, Tears of the Kingdom is a hard one because it intimidates me. Because I love Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom so much that, like, I don't feel good enough to play it. I'm like, oh, this is, I'm going to get lost and then I'm going to have to do a million side quests that are going to be fantastic and it's going to take so long. But I do want to start playing it again. I'm just not, I'm not exactly sure when, but I would say in the next month or so, I will probably play more because I do love Tears of the Kingdom. All right. Honestly, that looked kind of easy. It wasn't too bad. Some of the, uh, some of the agent, like, stealth levels are worse than others, for sure. But this one, this one was okay. All right. That is the green. Everyone's got whimsy for days. Oh, no. I wish I didn't have whimsy, but it's okay. <laughs> ah. Why am I stuck on this rock? Nico, you need to get it together. All right, there's the yellow. And then I think the red one is down here. This game is so cute. Oh my gosh. I love it. It's so whimsical. I love this code word that we've that we've just that we've created. Hmm. I assume the lever's up here. Oh, there it is. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Boop. Laser barrier has been turned off. Noise. And now we can go to the communications tower. Ha ha. All right, let's turn this baby off. All the wires. I just joined what whim what mission are we on today? We are right now. We are in the metal cave that we unlocked. I'm going to take a sip of tea. And we're we cleared out the agents. So we're looking for Miyako, the lost little villager who is uh, missing. And yeah. Did you break this? What? I thought you broke it. Well, when I report to boss, I'm sure as heck ain't saying that I broke it. Lying ain't tell him, <laughs> telling him that I broke it neither. These guys are always fighting. But they're so funny. And Kale Smoothies, thank you so much for the super chat. I really appreciate it. There's a little sticker. It's so cute. I watched you for years and finally caught a stream. Oh my gosh, thank you so much for the support. I appreciate it. I'm happy to have you here. Right now, we're saving cats and we're working with a cat to take down a large government conspiracy. You know how it is. <laughs> All right, how do we get metal? Is it... Oh, so we have like different rocks to mine? Ooh. <gasps> Guys, I found a diamond. Whoa, that seems really good. That seems good. That seems really good. I kind of don't want to donate that to the museum, but I feel like I should because <laughs> it's so fantastic. Yoink! <laughs> wow. I know. That was exactly what I thought when I did it. I was like, wow, a diamond. Speaking of wow, Loki is so good. Every time I say the word wow, it makes me think of Owen Wilson now, but... <laughs> oh, if anybody else is watching Loki, we're not going to discuss it because we don't... We, this is a spoiler-free zone, but oh my gosh, it's too good. 
It's killing me. I need to like get my second channel up and running so I can talk about it freely and like, I don't know, obsess over it. Ooh, gold. This cave is like bonkers. Wow. And boys and Becky, thank you so much for being a member for five months. Oh my goodness. I really appreciate it. Three streams in two days. What a blessing. I know. I'm unpredictable. But I'm trying my best. <gasps> Ooh, Jade. Okay. Do do do. All right. <laughs> Second channel. I know. It's not. There's nothing happening yet. I've had it for, I've made the second channel like a very long time ago, but nothing's happened yet. Soon maybe though. <gasps> Black opal. Ooh. I like the cats just chilling. They're so cute. Gold. There's so much. I'm getting so much here. Amazing. Whoa. Oh my goodness. I know I'm kind of on a on a roll with the streams. I figure the way that I manage my whimsy is by thinking if I was going to do this anyway, I might as well just stream it, you know? <laughs> so there's no need to feel whimsy. And then I just do it because in all honesty, I would probably be playing Mineko even if I wasn't streaming it because I just love this game and I want to finish the year, you know? That's my secret. I'm like the Hulk. Oh my God. Wait, I'm like the Hulk. Where he's like, that's my secret. I'm always angry. That's me. That's my secret. I'm always anxious. <laughs> and it constantly drives me to, I don't know, do things. It motivates me in a very weird way. We're getting so many gems. What a bountiful cave. All right, metal rock and a jade. It seems like we've gotten a good assortment of gems for certain. I'm not sure if we got all the different kinds that you can get, but it kind of feels that way. And we got the metal, which means that we can now smelt that down and make the where am I even? We can make the yokai zipper pouch for the little uh, duck kid in town, you know? <laughs> oh, goodness. My whimsy keeps me going. It's an, an unfortunate truth. But yeah, I'm trying to. Yeah, I'm trying to be in my streamer era. Every time I say I'm in my streamer era, something happens and then I'm suddenly like don't stream for like a million years. But this time, this time is different, I tell you. I did I didn't even think I said but I got a new desk and it's large there's so many th there's so much space for objects it's very exciting anywho I'm gonna leave now <laughs> because we got so much stuff and I didn't see any gears in there at all we'll have to check another area and see if we can find more Oh, it's Bobo time, baby. Hey, yo, Mineko. Hey, yo, Bobo. -o. So come on, give me the lowdown. What happened out there? Miyako's still nowhere to be found. Darn. Well, there are still a ton of places we could look, so it's not over yet. How about you? Are you able to make any progress in your research? I don't think Bobo's doing anything. Oh, yeah, I was. So as we discussed earlier, I followed the money. What money? Just, just money. I followed it. Don't worry about it. Anyway. Where does almost all the money pass through on this island? Uh, <laughs> me? I seem to be the only one doing anything here. Yes, that. Oh, bingo, you figured it out. You must be the leader of the agents. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Settle down, Bobo. Settle down. Come on, get serious here. The night market. This, this whole island runs on the economy of the night market. Somebody is making a lot of money there. Enough to fund the massive operation of the agents? Oh! <gasps> Wait, our night market organizer would never, right? The guy with the ball who's bald but wears a bald cap anyway? I will be so hurt. 
I will be so hurt. I mean, maybe. I'm still theorizing here. In the meantime, the next time you're at the night market, do some investigating. Poke around to see if anyone looks suspicious. Hmm. Interesting. So we're just going to profile people based on how suspicious they look? That's a fair question. Yeah. Be Saudis. Bobo, you have no, like, boundaries or morals, but... Just, for some reason, I respect that. Um, I needed to give the lanterns to Granny Fanny, but I don't... I think she's asleep. Oh, Miyako's there. <laughs> don't look at... Don't look at her. She's still lost, I swear. But, let's go look for a gear somewhere. Hmm. I'm trying to think... Where we haven't been? Um, let's go to the birch forest. The other one was in like the little temple area, so maybe there. Hmm. I'll pick up the hairballs while we're here too, because. Those will be useful for crafting stuff. Hmm. No gears. Pretty sure. Maybe here? Lemon in. Why can't I get in? Wait, why are the doors closed? What? a daytime only thing what how do i why why um am i just forgetting something how do i get in there wasn't there a switch or something to open that why is it close oh oh i found the gear or the machine part Ooh, never mind okay i guess we don't need to get in there I don't know why that's closed. I thought that that was open before, but it's okay. We're fine. So now we have, I think, three? Do we have three? All right. I, I'll never know, but I assume three. Because we got one in the cave, we got one here, and we got one at the other place. The garden. <laughs> What's a worm burger? A worm burger is the name that our father lovingly has bestowed upon us. And it has become a little bit of a cult. So now we're just the worm burgers, you know? <gasps> oh, before you head off again, make sure to take some food with you. Thanks, Dad. You got it, Senbei face. Pains me to see people go hungry. Guess that's why I used to run a ramen shop on the mainland, huh? I miss that old place. Me too. I'm glad you remember it. If they ever build a ramen shop out here, you know I'll be first in line to apply for a job. Stop. Is my dad going to work at a ramen shop? That would be so precious. That would actually be so cute. I would be so happy for dad. Ooh. Okay, I'm going to make some metal ingots. And then let's craft up. Um, yes, this. The yokai face zipper pouch. I'm crafting it so carefully because I care so much about the duck child. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Oh, looking great. Nice! <laughs> Worm burger should be your second channel. Ugh, if I hadn't already made it, you know, maybe I would. But, oh, it's just unfortunately... Unfortunately, I can't. All right. It is a Tuesday. What are we up to? Oh, guys! Look! Our second cat is blooming! Wow. Nature is beautiful. What do we name this one? We'll name it... N Tiny Nico. <laughs> so close to the end of summer. I know. Yeah, we should probably send Nico to get something, honestly. I've, I've been kind of lazy about that. Maybe, do you want to go get um some mulberries? I feel like I have the least of those. Wormburger's definitely not a cult. We're a sweet family. That's true. That's true. 
I'm sorry. Yeah, that's Nico Jr. I didn't mean to say that Wormburger was a cult. It's a very lovely family. All right, so we're on the hunt for the, the duck guy. Oh, and we have to give Granny Fanny her lanterns. There we go. Our second heart. Lovely. Okay, now this is definitely not non-half bad. I will gladly accept this. Go <laughs> Happy to hear it. Thank you. Now I can get used to that. Let me see what I have around here for you. Veggie juice. Okay. Now she needs two box flowers. Oh, and I have a raccoon donut for Miyaku, who's definitely missing. <laughs> Look at that missing child who is currently not missing. Yeah, she's she's fine. She's fine. And she even gave me two veggie juice. Have you heard of boximals? Do they make a raccoon boximal? I literally called that. I told you that she was going to want it. We're like best friends, even though she's missing and not here right now, technically. All right, if you give it to me, you wouldn't have it. And you're just like, okay with that? Yeah, I'll, I have two, I think. That's cool of you. Don't tell anyone I said that. Let me see if I have anything for you. Two black ramen. So now she wants a raccoon bedroll. Okay, okay. Oh, okay, first of all, we got to check with Ruby. A boy's t-shirt? I know somebody in town is definitely going to want that at some point. And then we have this yokai face zipper pouch for this little goober. Whoa, I can have this? Just like that? This is so cool. I'm going to hide snacks in there and stuff. Oh yeah, and use it for research. <gasps> Two boximal blind boxes. Now they want a yokai action figure. Okay, okay. Perfect. This is going well. Oh boy. Let's see, is there anything that we can donate? Oh, we have to donate our gems. I knew it. I knew that there was something I was forgetting. So I'm gonna... Ooh, we got two diamonds? Why are we rich right now? One trip to the metal cave and suddenly... Okay. Can I donate gold? I already... Oh, there we go. So we have gold, diamond... Our collection looks fantastic, and it'll we only need one more donation to open. And I have like a bajillion donations, so we're actually going to be able to open this, which is really cool. Oh, now we have two open. Two museums, the gem museum and the fish museum. Ooh, we got two block boximal blind boxes and a bunch of food. But we're not even done. We still have the opal. We might, like, finish this. Hello? We have the opal. And then... Metal rock? Wow. And then finally... The jade! Wait, we actually finished it! No way! That's so fun! Museum is complete! Splendid, I've spent a lifetime hoping to one day see this place complete. Now I can happily spend the rest of my life showing the world the beauty that is all around us. Oh, I'd like to grant you the title of Honorary Curator of the Gem Museum. <gasps> I'm a curator! Look at it! We finished the Gem Museum and it's so cute and beautiful. Cutiful. <laughs> I love it! Why don't boximal blind boxes exist in real life? Oh my gosh. If they did, I would want them now. I, like, if boximal blind boxes ever become a thing, I'm gonna do a video opening like 50 of them. I'm not even kidding. I would be so obsessed. But let's open these ones, the ones we just got. We're looking for a catfish one, which is, ooh, tuna, which is apparently the rarest of them all. So our odds are not good. We got another bowl cut one. Spending $300 on boximals. I've done it once, I'll do it again. You know it. You received a gold cat. Ugh, catfish is so hard to get. What on earth? Darn it. Okay, well. Hmm. 
let's see Bobo's mom wants like an art thing which I just don't want to do I might try and sell some stuff I have a bunch of these boximals like I don't need the raccoon one anymore I don't need this one anymore um I don't think we need these sparkly rocks I was told that you can just sell them and then hmm like the crabs I'm just gonna sell all my extra stuff and get a bunch of money we have three snail ones I don't know why Wow, I'm so rich. Look at this. I had money all along. I was just complaining about nothing. <laughs> oh, goodness. And Mac the Cat Dad, thank you so much for being here. I really appreciate it. I hope you have a fantastic time working. Sorry for t sapping so much of your time. <laughs> but thank you. And I will be playing more Story of Seasons for certain. I want to finish that up as well. I've been on a hiatus because so many fantastic games have been getting released and it's a lot to keep up with. <laughs> but we will get back to it. Okay. Now I think with the money that we just made, I'm going to get the shovel. You have three gold cap boximals. Yeah, I don't know. I might even have four. I might have one at home. I don't know how I did that. All right. Anybody with a shovel should be allowed to travel to the beach. There used to be a dude at the beach that ran a metal detecting booth. Ooh valuable goods to be unearthed out there time to cause a little more trouble huh careful out there the agents are still running rampant all in the name of finding miyako they say but no one has received any word on any progress being made here they have communication towers and tripwires and all sorts of traps laid out across the island that doesn't sound to me like equipment you use to find a missing person you know you're on to something wait hank the hunk was an agent I, uh... Oh! Yeah! Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. This is a lot to take in. He does have the build of an agent. I'm... Hank! He's hunky and he has a dark past. This is... This is wowie zowie for certain. <laughs> Back when the agency first appeared, they did a lot of heavy recruiting out here. And yeah, I guess I was an agent for a brief period of time. Whoa. Things at the store were slow and the salary was decent. The job sounded easy enough. Stand over here, stand over there, and make sure the people are staying safe. But I soon developed my suspicions about the agency when I realized we weren't actually keeping people away from danger. We were keeping people away from us us and our real operations which was i don't know that was never shared with me i was only brought in to provide extra muscle for the agency oh you would be hank the hunk once i started raising questions about the mission they must have realized i actually had a brain to go with this bod no way needless to say i was promptly discharged from the group whoa who's in charge i barely made it past a week with them there's no chance they were going to share that info with me if anything i do have my suspicions though back when i joined up with the agency there was one person in particular who started acting very differently toward me oh my god who make your guesses who do you think it is oh my gosh this is blowing my mind the plot's as thick as hank don't say these things well i was talking to they're gonna come in i knew it oh hello hey yeah hank What's the good word, Hank? I, I don't know. What's this all about? We're just here to do a little shopping, ain't we, Bonesy? Yeah, sure, Mugs. We're just looking to buy a, uh... Hey, Mugsy, what kind of store is this anyway? You know, it's a store for house things, a house store. A house. We'd like to buy one house, please. Oh, cute couple buying their first house together. Love that for you. <laughs> Love that. Sorry, I seem to be fresh out of houses today, so unless there's anything else I can help you with, why not? Sure, you can help us with something. I just bought a shovel. Can I just, like, whack him in the head with the shovel? They, nobody treats Hank the Hunk this way. Hey, kid, don't you got somewhere better to be on a Tuesday than here in a house store? 
Like, don't you? Don't you have a child to find? Shouldn't you be minding your own business? Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. You know what, Mugs? I think I'm all set here. I guess I don't need a house after all. Same neither, Bonesy. So how's about we head out for now and return later when we have more business for all Hanky Boy here? Don't call him Hanky Boy, please. <laughs> the air quotes around business should indicate to you that when we say business, we don't mean business in the traditional sense of a monetary exchange for goods, Hanky Boy. He gets it, Bonesy. He gets it. We'll hear. I mean, we'll see you later. Hanky boy. Wow. What? Yeah, who, well, well, now can you tell me who's in charge? Well, I guess that's that. You better head on out too, kid. I'm sure the agents are listening in on us right now, somehow. Meet me back here first thing tomorrow morning, and we're going to figure out a way to take him down. Once and for all. Okay, sounds good. I better leave right now to head back home. Okay, sounds good. Good luck in your future endeavors. Whoa. That was juicy. Bobo, did you hear any of that? Nope. Bobo's grounded and standing there oblivious. Whoa. Okay, let's go to the beach. This is our last location for now, I think. Wow. That was fantastic. Hank is cool. All right. Okay, Nico, Miyako could be anywhere around here. Of course, this place is crawling with agents. So we got to take down the towers and free the cats. Look, let's look for items around here that might get their attention. Oh, cool, 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 cool. Okay, gotcha. I think that Hank is going to disappear and not be there tomorrow. How dare you? Don't say that. How dare you say that? You're so right, but I hate that. Oh, Darn, that didn't even cross my mind. Dang it, I'm such a bad agent. Oh, okay. You're so right about that. Dang it. That's so disappointing. Who, are, who is this fellow? Hey, aren't you the delivery boy I met down on the docks? That's me. So I assume you're living your best life now. I was, until the agent showed up here and booted everyone off the beach. I can't even approach them because I no longer have a delivery outfit. Wait, why am I not wearing mine? Oh, nuts. Uh, shoot. I think I need a delivery outfit. I don't think I can change here. Uh... Let's see. Is there anything Nico can do? What is going on? Crows seem to be blocking certain items of interest. Find a way to scare them off? What if I, yeah, rattle the trash can? Spotted purple beach towel. Okay. Fascinating. Oh, your, your outfit resets after every night market? Mm. <laughs> the plot hankins don't say that i found a snorkel we got a radio is this like miyako stuff or is this just like up for grabs i don't even know a volleyball hmm do i have to go back to the house and put that on and then just come back at night or something i don't know if that'll reset my progress probably not i I don't really know. And a beach ball. Oh. Okay, and that's the communication tower. Which we can't do until we... Uh, save all the cats. So... Oh, this is the last thing. Bonk! Striped pink beach towel. Is that everything? I think it resets the progress. Oh, that's so unfortunate. Well, I don't know what to do with those items, so probably we should just go. <laughs> go. I think we need to be wearing the delivery uniform, which is so unfortunate because I'm always wearing it. But it like reset after the night market, so now I'm not wearing it. But that's okay. That wasn't too bad anyway. 
We also need to be crafting things for the, the next night market. Things to sell. Um. Ooh, Hank the Hunk tote bag. Ooh. I have interest in that. And we need to make box flowers for Granny Fanny. So I might just go ahead and do that now. <gasps> Perfect. Amazing. Okay. Number two. Hank merch. Hank oh. Yeah, I I love the Hank tote bag. We've got some Hank merch here. Everybody's a fan of Hank, you know? Um I'm gonna make a Sakura fan. Because I think these sell for a lot. Okay. We should probably go send Nico out to get some, like, paper or wood or something as well. Uh, let's go get some wood, please. Thank you, my dear assistant. I love that we have two cats now. We should grow another one. And it's technically not the end of the day, but I'm gonna go to sleep anyway. <laughs> we have four whole days left. Okay, game saved. Let's do this thing. Now I've got my delivery outfit on. I'm ready to rumble. You got some wood. I'm going to send you out for wood again because I don't think I have very much. Check on Hank. Emily, I'm scared. I'm so scared. Hank, please be there. Please be there, Hank. Oh, I got mail. Hold on. Hank can wait. A flyer from Hank's tool store. The tool store is currently closed. More information to follow? No. Say it isn't so. No. Not Hank. Not Hank the hunk. No. Where the heck did Hank go? No. They were right. <laughs> Not Hank. This is the worst day. I could seriously shed a tear. This is, this is, this is awful. This is awful news. Oh. Well, at least Granny Fanny has her box flowers. <laughs> That's so upsetting. They took Hank. How do we get him back? Oh. Oh, I got two box mold blind boxes though. Let's open those. Oh. <gasps> And now Granny Fanny wants a Hank the Hunk tote bag? Stop, I'm processing my trauma. Don't make me. She doesn't even know the tra the tragedy that has occurred. Ooh, a crab. Please be a catfish, please be a catfish, please be a catfish. It's a pug. That's new though, and that's actually good because probably the, the gal that loves dogs is gonna want that at some point, you know? Oh, let's go craft a Hank the Hunk tote bag in his memory. He hunked a long life and he will be missed dearly. Oh, Hank, no. There's a large Hank shaped hole in my heart. A very thick one. Ah. <sighs> A perfect Hank the Hunk tote bag. Just like him. I'm hunkfully, whimsically crying. <laughs> that is such an interesting sentence, but I get it, you know? Alright, here you go, Granny. Sad. We're almost full hearts with Granny Fanny, though. This will definitely do. Let me see. One sushi to go. This place does look a little bit better since you arrived, I must admit. If you can help me with one last thing, I should be done bothering you. It's about Miyako. I took her in a couple years ago and she came to me without complaint, without hesitation. She's even selling at the night market to help us with our bills, my goodness. She may seem tough and somewhat cold on the outside, but she's really... I just want to do something for her. Help me build a tree house. I am like 10. Goodness gracious. <laughs> okay. We'll keep that on the back burner. 
This person wants a dog bouquet, but I don't think we can make one. So instead, let's go back to the beach and check out that little thing. He was a good man. A very thick, beautiful man. He was. We will whimsically miss your hunkness. <gasps> Wait, Hank, it's like your highness, but it's your hunkness. <gasps> your hunkness. That's Hank to us. Or he was. But it's okay. All right, so we're back here. We have our delivery outfit on now. Hello? I'm just a little... Oh. I need my cooler box. Oh, so okay, that's what... We need to get all this stuff because this is the stuff they're missing. And then we need to return it to them. It's all coming together. I love it. I should never have left. I let Hank down. Danielle, you can't take all the blame. It was not your fault. Hank was doing what he thought was best. He would be proud of us. We shall now refer to him as your royal hunkness. <laughs> true our royal hunkness is missing we must rescue him and oh my goodness hen -na 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 -na. welcome welcome Wormburger. this is so exciting welcome welcome to the stream we're talking about hank the hunk i hope you know who it is but actually i hope you don't because then you'll have to grieve him because he's missing <laughs> all right beach ball I must say, none of those items were a cooler, so maybe my, maybe I was off. Hold on. Um, no, actually, I think it was right because that person wanted a beach ball. Okay. Hold on. Let me go down. I'm not going to lie. Hank the hunk is kind of punk. Yeah, right? He's amazing. I love Hank. Okay, Nico, let's navigate back. And then, okay. Oh, Mineko can find things too? Okay, that makes a lot of sense. Here, take all of the things I found, dear child. All right, um, beach ball? I think, can I only do one at a time? No, I can just pick them up. All right, cool. radio and it's out okay so we need a cooler which i i haven't seen one but we can return this beach ball i've been looking all over for this you can free the cat while the agent is distracted oh i thought that's what they were saying i thought they were saying you can free the cat while i'm distracted with my beach ball <laughs> i was like why would you say that to me all right what do you need snorkel i just happen to have that all right, wait, are they snorkeling? Wait, I must watch. Where did they go? They just walked into the ocean. All right, safe travels. Uh, spotted beach towel. Ooh, hello. Hank the hunk. Who's that? Ah, <laughs> oh, but there's just no alliteration. Agent the... Agent the... Ah. Uh, Ow. <laughs> no. <laughs> it's just never it's never gonna be the same. Okay, this person's listening to some tunes. And asleep. Perfect. I have the bento box for this person. We will free this cat. And then Oh, there's the cooler. Perfect. A volleyball. I've gotcha. Gotcha covered. And two cats left. Ooh, hello. <laughs> what does this person want? Striped towel? Ooh. This guy, too. I love the pose they strike. All right. Perfect. <laughs> Agent the attractive. This is true. You're all a lot better <laughs> than me at this. Oh, shoot. I walked Nico. Oh, I guess I needed to anyway to give the items. I was so upset. But okay. Now we have distracted all the agents. Freed the cats. So we are going to... Uh... 
take down the communications tower. Bum, bum, ba -num, bum, ba -na 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 -na. How haven't the agents been fired yet? That's a fantastic question. I don't know. They really should have been, though. All right. And tower down, one to go? There's another? I guess maybe there's one for Mineko, too. I don't remember seeing a tower. I was just thinking about Hank. Maybe over here? Uh, did I just miss a whole time? Yep, I just did not, did not see it. Okay, looks like that did it. Ooh, boss ain't gonna be happy about this. Hey, Bonesy, what the heck happened over here? It wasn't done by me, Mugsy for honest. Well, it ain't not me neither, Bonesy. Well, if it wasn't ain't not done by you and it wasn't ain't not done by me, then who was it? Again, <laughs> he's just turned into Gollum for a minute there. Okay, forget it. We got that new shipment of stuff coming in soon. Won't be able to hide for very long now. Ooh, intrigue. Say, Bonesy, maybe it was that kid. Kid, what are you on about, Mugs? You know, that kid that's been all up in our business lately. Oh, that kid? With the face? But I thought we took care of that kid already, Mugsy. She ain't gonna be found... For a long, long... <gasps> they took Miyako? Oh, I don't know why I didn't expect that. Whoa. Well, okay, let's dig some digging spots, I suppose. Um, <laughs> Looks like Miyako was nowhere to be seen here. Whoa. I really thought Bobo took her out. It was seeming that way for a minute. Uh, let's try digging. It's 20 bucks, but then we get to dig. Green light will blink faster when you're close to a target. Dig when you've made a hit. Oh. I didn't realize I had to move. I am so bad at this. It's like criminal. Hold on, let me try again. I was putting all of my brain power into that. Okay. Wait, how do I dig? Oh, this is just tragic. I'm so bad at this. Use the run button to move it faster. Oh, okay, okay. Thank you. <laughs> I was like, why am I so awful? Scanning. <laughs> Did I find anything? did it go that bananas and I still didn't find anything what <laughs> I'm so bad at this I'm so bad at this it's embarrassing I'm leaving I'm leaving I'm leaving I'm leaving I'm leaving I'm leaving I just don't care all right my next bobs so anything unfortunately no sign of Miyako there either this is not good, Manex. Not good. She must be either hurt badly, lost in the wild, or worse. What's worse than being hurt or lost? Oh, Bobo. <laughs> what? Oh, were you able to interrogate people at the night market yet? Haven't gotten around to it yet because they happen on sun Saturdays and it has been a Saturday, but that's okay. Oh, come on, man. Maybe the market host is involved. You know, I did see him talking to a couple agents the other day. No, I said that. Oh no. What? That's huge. You're just telling me this now? I didn't quite hear what they were talking about. They quickly left and headed for the market when I showed up. 
What? It's gotta be him in charge. Who else would have access to the island's finances like the market host would? We gotta find Hank. He used to be an agent, so he would know. What? Hank was an agent? He's gotta be in charge. Oh, Bobo. This is just not... He said he was only an agent for a short period of time before he was promoted to the head of operations. Think about it. Why do you think he was providing you ways to travel around the island? To take down the agents? Wake up and smell the Sakura, Manex. He's luring you to them. Whatever happened to Miyako is just a preview of what they're going to do to you. Oh, say it isn't so. Or maybe it's your dad. Or maybe <laughs> you're spiraling, Bobo. Okay, okay. We can't just blindly accuse everyone on the island without evidence. I thought you were a man of logic and facts. Okay, okay. Okay. Well, this just makes it even more important to find Miyako. If the agents did something to her, she must have a ton of info on what this operation's all about. You're gonna have to check out the bamboo forest. I mean, you need to go through there to get to the Nico temple. Maybe Miyako was looking for that. It's an ancient community of Nico worshippers who live out by the bamboo forest. What? And you're just telling me about this now? Yeah. All right, fair. Traditionally, anyone who wishes to cross to the Northern Island needs to receive a blessing from the folks there. Knowing Miyako, I doubt she was able to receive their blessings, so she's got to be lost out in the bamboo forest. Huh, the tool store is closed down. I don't know how we're going to make it there. Tool store, forget the tool store. This is a matter of life and hurt, and Miyako could be hurt out there. What do I do? Just go? Yeah. I think our days of obeying the agency's rules are over. Head to the bamboo forest and find Miyako, dude. Let's just hope we're not too late. Too late for what? What would happen to her? What is it? Well, whatever it is, let me know when you find out. I gotta go back home before I get even grounded or you Saudis. Oh, Bobo. What a what a child. And Doobie, thank you so much for the super chat. I really, really appreciate it. You were just too kind. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Sorry, Bobo was just yammering on. I couldn't get to it, but I saw it. But thank you, for real. All right, so now we have to go to the bamboo forest and let's see. We have to get our thing from Nico. Oh, you know something, kiddo? I'm doing it. Hmm? Why wait around here? Oh, why wait around for someone to open a restaurant around here? I'm going to start my own. <gasps> I can help. Oh, I couldn't ask my own flesh and blood for help. But in this economy, I can't really turn down free help. I mean, we fix up our house together. I'm sure we can build a restaurant too. Oh my gosh, we're going to build our ramen shop. I'll stake out some locations and we'll get started tomorrow. Sounds great. Why am I going to cry right now? <laughs> Finally, dad is doing something. Cindy, the dad slander. <laughs> Wait, that's so cute. We're going to build a ramen shop together. Oh. That's so precious. Wow. My heart. Okay. Well. We have some time. And I want to go check out... Maybe the dock? We still need some machine parts so that we can get the other villager to move in. Hmm. Bum, bum, bum. Hmm. Let me know if you see any gears at all. My eyes are peeled, but I see nothing. <gasps> I found one. Got it. Oh yeah. Okay. Sorry, I was just so startled. My neighbors just started going like feral downstairs and it was <laughs> it was very loud and shaking the floor. That was so shocking. Okay. Oh my gosh. My floor is positively quaking. Okay. We're looking at the mountain again. Just Nico and I. The agents are downstairs. Oh, Danielle, no. 
And Doobie, thank you so much. Oh my gosh. I really appreciate you watching the VOD and hanging out. You're too kind. I hope you enjoy our elephant adventures. All right. It's happening, Nico. Me and my dad are going to set up a ramen shop here in town. So precious. I'm glad my dad finally found something he really wants to do here. Of course, I want him to be happy. I guess it makes it more official that we're here now. Not that I don't like it here, but I guess I always had a feeling in the back of my mind that we're eventually going to go back home. My old home on the mainland, I mean. Oh, too bad. I didn't even say bye to my friends, Nico. They started to say it as I was leaving, but I didn't let them finish. I just kept telling them, I'll see you soon. I'll see you soon. And then we hopped on the boat to come here. Well, that seems like your fault, kind of. I mean, yeah, of course I could still see them again someday. I could always go visit them myself when I'm older, but I don't know. I guess I just never really fully processed all or any of this. There really isn't anyone to talk to about this stuff when you're the new kid. I'm sure you can relate. What, what about Bobo? Bobo is a fan or Bobo's mom. That's a real answer. What about Bobo's mom? Or dad? I don't know if you can see it from here, but way out there is the Northern Island. They say it's the last island that leads directly to Mount Fugu. Nobody really goes there these days, I've heard. But it looks like it's the only way to the mountain. We're going to get you home, Nico. Oh, <laughs> I have a question. Shouldn't Mineko be in school? You know, fair point. Uh, yes. I don't... Yeah, yeah, we're in detective school. It's called practical learning. No, 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 don't sleep. It's, it's called being taught by experience. You feel? And I'm having Nico collect sand now from the beach because I'm dreadful at it. And apparently sand is something we're going to need. I don't really know why yet, but I'm loving it. Okay, so what is their craft? I don't really, I don't know. I'm going to make another fan. <laughs> Bobo's the real detective? Are you joshing me? Bobo has been... Huh? Morning, potato head. I was going to say Bobo has been retired. What is it? Grounded. Bobo's been grounded for the past like two months. Morning, potato head. Let's go. I found the spot. The spot for... Oh, I guess we're going. This is so exciting for dad. Oh, I love this. I'm going to cry. <gasps> oh, here it is. Here's what? The spot, the spot. Yep, this is going to be our new dad's ramen shop. Uh, it looks great, dad. I mean, I know it doesn't look like much now, but I'm sure with a little bit of love, we could just give me deja vu. For the first time we moved here? Yeah. But also, of the time I started my first ramen shop back on the mainland. How long ago that was now? Must have been... Wow, yeah, you were barely even one at the time. That place, I tell ya. It was always filled with all of our friends and family. It was our base. You remember Uncle Makun, right? Yeah, sure. We act he actually met Auntie Rinka at my shop. She was my host there. After putting you kiddos to bed, we would... Oh, this is really cute. What the heck? Playing cards, laughing, drinking sodas until the sun came up. The older we got and the older you kids got, the more those nights became shorter and shorter until we stopped having them all together. And that's nobody's fault. It was all just a part of prioritizing our lives as we grow. It would be neat to create a whole new set of memories, not just for ourselves, but for everyone who visits this new place. Oh, Maybe our new ramen shop could eventually become base for a new generation of families and friends. Oh my gosh! Cute! Guess we should get to work. We could use 50 wood to get started. Do I already have that? <laughs> nope. How much do I have? 36? Okay, we can get some wood today. What is going on? Bobo is the true final boss? Bobo's a double agent? <laughs> you guys! I don't think Bobo's the bad guy. Bobo hasn't even left his ha- Wait. Or is he grounded? Wait a moment. 
honestly, if Bobo is act, I would lose my mind. And I know that they have it in them because our Hank the Hunk was an agent already. Ooh, hello, Ruby. A black fedora. Um, no. Thank you so much, though. Ooh. Guys. That tracks. Now I'm like, if Bobo isn't a double agent, I'm going to be a little disappointed. I won't lie. That is so funny. Uh, oh, wait, shoot. I should not have sold that. Well, too late now. Let's sell the market host box and mole. And then we need one more machine part to get the other person moved in. We have nine golden hairballs. Nobody ever wants them, so I'm selling them. I don't really want this golden cat box and mole. Is the tuna sells for like nothing? Ooh. Ow. That stuff sells for a lot. How much is this? We need the gem. Whoa. Gem craft bench, art craft bench. Okay. We need to get another uh, craft bench because we've gotten all the tools. So now we need to be um, crafting as many things as we can and giving out gifts to everybody. And also for like selling at the night market too. But yeah, all the villagers were starting to get to the point where they want more complicated thingies. Like uh, the like what's it called the boys necklace or bracelet or something like that's um something we need the jewelry bench for for the craft table <laughs> okay we're in the dark forest i don't think we've is there a gear here possibly oh my gosh there is that's the last gear wow we just killed two birds with one stone two eggs in my basket so now we can get that last villager to move into the uh, into the town, which is so exciting. And also means that we should be getting extra wood because we're going to need to not only give the wood for the ramen shop, but also build their house. So lots to do. Lots to do. We're getting a lot done, though, which is very exciting. Bonk. and bonk wow and now i'm kind of invested in if bobo is the one behind this whole thing i mean he's like a seven-year-old boy he can't but but what if he is oh i need to know it wouldn't be bobo but bobo wait a minute I don't even remember. On our first day, Bobo was there when I, like, almost died. And then he didn't even, like, tell anybody about it. Am I making this up? Or is Bobo maybe the villain? That would be incredible. What if he's actually 50? He's, yeah. He just has, like, a boyish face. He's got, like, one of those young faces. <laughs> Oh my gosh, wait a moment. I will actually lose my mind if, if it's Bobo. He's an 150 year old demon? If Bobo is a demon, I will literally... I, I don't know what I'll do. I'll like, give you money. <laughs> I will give you money if Bobo is a demon. I will, I will, I will gift memberships or something. Or if Bobo's the bad guy. That would be funny. I don't even believe that that's possible. But if it does happen, I'll do something. <laughs> wow. The revelations we're having. Um, I'm actually going to go back to the caves. And we should talk with the person. The other, the last villager to move in. Hello. Are you able to find the machine parts? There you go. Oh, these are all the missing parts. I sure hope it wasn't too arduous of an ordeal to find these. Nope. A reward would help. I wish I had something I could give you for all your help. It isn't much, but you can have everything I found in the cave while I was searching. A blind box, kitten candy, 
Ramune? All right. The D Garbig of Fire should be up and running at the next night market, and I hope to see you there. Interesting. Bring any failed garbage craft items to me at the night market, and I'll show you what this thing can do. <gasps> oh. Wait, that's actually so cool. Unfortunately, I threw away my failed items because I was upset that I failed. So that was really on... That's my bad. <laughs> so... Oops. Yeah, why was that in a cave? I was thinking. I was like, was the kitten candy just sitting on a rock? Like, why? Why? Okay. Nico has found us more sand. And I don't know what the sand is for. But we should probably just ask him to get more sand tomorrow. And if dad is still standing over there, I'm going to just build the ramen shop as well before we go to bed. We can also... Wait, this person might not be here. No, they're not outside. But Koji is. Let's go, baby. Koji's awake at all hours of the day. And I respect that. Papa? <gasps> here he is. All right. Here's the wood. There you go, kiddo. We found them all. That should be enough to set up the frame of our building. Oh, it's so cute. Not bad, huh? Here's something I found for you. Some ramen. All right, what's our next task? 50 papers? Oh, boy. How many of those do I have? 10? Oh, dad. Catfish? Boxmal? Another pug. Darn. I hope our restaurant is up to code. I sure hope so, too. That would be so sad if my dad was, like, all excited about the ramen shop and then opened it up with my help and then we got shut down by the health agency. What is it called? Whoever shuts things down. The people from Ratatouille. All right. We have two days left in the summer. Two days left of this stream. Let's get some good stuff done. Let's... I don't know. I don't have any concrete goals, but let's just do a lot of things. First of all, we'll send off Nico to find some sand. Health department. <laughs> yeah, the health inspectors. That's what they're called. I don't even remember what I said, but I know it was so embarrassingly wrong. Okay. What's going on here? We have all the people... I want to give the wood to this new little person. This looks like a perfect place. Who knows what my next great invention will be? I don't know, but here is some wood. You really wouldn't mind parting with this high quality lumber? I'm speechless. All right. What a solid start. Please accept this. Black ramen. I'm getting so much of the ramen. Oh, 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 okay. Granny Fanny, I know you're just asking for me for the treehouse. Please stop. Okay. So... We need to get paper today, but I think that we should head to the bamboo forest up here. And we should check out what the Nico shrine is. Wait, there's agents here? How, dude? Oh, this is 10 cats? Okay, Nico. Miyako isn't here? Well, I don't know. We're really running out of places to look. Oh boy, oh boy. Alright, go team go. How is it? Why isn't Bobo helping one bit? Let me know. Cats up there surrounded by crows. Look for something down here to get rid of the birds. Okay, this one looks a lot more difficult than the other ones. He's grounded. He's been grounded this entire time. At a certain point, I think you, you, you're just scared. What is this? I got bird seed. That'll be helpful. There's so many. Oh my. There's like tunnels. Go. I. I literally crawled. I crouched. I'll crouch through the tunnel. Because he's suspicious. You know why. I think you guys might be onto something. E 
Okay. Oh, I will literally lose my marbles if Bobo is evil. I'm not even kidding you. I hope that it's the truth. Okay, so this leads up here. Ooh, we have more bird seed. And then that goes through the bushes. I've got to go this way. And then... I haven't gone to the right here. What is through here? Another tunnel. I am so lost. But I'm having a fantastic time. And then this goes to... Nothing? Okay. What about this one? Goes up. <laughs> I'm so lost. <gasps> I thought they were... Okay. I thought they were stopping. Oh, they stopped. Free that cat. And run. That was very close. All right, we have another thing to turn off here. Some bird seed. Oh, I thought there was a tunnel. Nope. Hmm. This one leads to another cat. Oh, I turned this off. Okay, perfect. Free the cat. Oh my God, I'm so lost. I found more bird seed though. How am I ever gonna get back? Oh lord. Why do they need flashlights at like noon? That is a fantastic question. I'm gonna put that bird seed there for Nico. And then. Okay, this is the communication tower. So I think I did everything as Mineko, hopefully? Except it wasn't super helpful because now I need to go retrieve the bird seed before I can do anything up here. So I uh, love that for me. I'm so helpful. Is it... Wh where did I put it? How far did I travel? Oh my gosh. Oh, it's right here. Beautiful. I only have five though. And there's seven cats left? That does... That math isn't mathing. I tell ya. We'll do what we can. We might not have found all the seeds in the maze. That is unfortunate. I did not want to have to go back through there. Okay, release this little guy. Honestly, I don't think I got all the seeds because I never saw the second flag, so... Ugh. Yeah. That does make sense. All right, be free, little one. And then we have one more bag of seeds left. But okay, we freed all the ones in the beginning. So let's see, let's go to the end and see where the other cats are. Or they might be in the maze. It might not even be that we need seeds as Nico. It might be that we just never saved them in the maze. All right, let's put this here. Free the little kitten. They're all black cats today. Anybody notice that? That seems unlucky for the agents. Oh, they are in the maze. No. Oh gosh, this is going to be a fun one. All right, we have two cats left to find here. They're not there. How did I possibly miss them? I feel like I went through every single tunnel. Maybe not. Ooh, maybe I didn't go through this one? Uh... Oh, there's one. Whoop. Saved you. Okay, don't send me back to the beginning. I'm begging, I'm begging, I'm begging. That was fantastic. All right, and then up this way. I think this is where this, the second flag is. Yeah, 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 yeah. We never came here. There's nothing that way? Hmm. We must have missed something. 
We must have missed something. My heart is beating fast. Because of me? I'm so sorry. This is supposed to be a calming experience. Wait, maybe... Is there a cat here? Just like hiding? It can't be, right? No. This is just a dead end. Hmm. Cat lost stressed. Bobo is taking hold of me. Oh no. Not Bobo the demon. This is not good. Is it is it up this way? I'm begging. Please, cat. Oh, I found it. Okay. Should be safe to check out the communication towers. Okay, perfect. I don't know how I missed that. This is an extensive bamboo forest. All right, so now we have to go back the way we came because I'm pretty sure there was a communication tower where we were. I, I don't even remember. <laughs> oh my gosh. And goodbye, Cindy. Thank you so much for hanging out. I really appreciate it. I hope you have a great rest of your night. Don't be possessed by Bobo, please. <laughs> Good night, Wormburger. Okay, go this way and pull the wires. Bada bing, bada boom. Beautiful. And then let's pull these ones. And then I think we're done here. Oh, it's these two knuckleheads. More towers down, huh? I swear, I was watching the whole time and I didn't see nothing. Let's face it, these towers are pieces of junk. That's what you get when you work for that old cheapskate. Hmm. Are you going to offer up your own money to fund a mission to help everyone on Mount Fugu Island? I don't have that kind... What? You don't have that kind of money? That's funny. You sure seemed like you had that kind of money when you were insinuating that our boss was a cheapskate. It was just a joke. It was just a joke. I know. And I said that was funny that you would say that. What? I don't like it when you guys fight. <laughs> Me either. I'm lost. Ah, shut up. Well, our new supplies should be delivered to shore any moment now. Come on. You all got the memo. We're moving our operations to the Northern Island. Oh, wait. Shouldn't we get a blessing from the people of the Nico Temple to pass? Ha ha ha. Ha ha. Wow. They don't even... They're not even respecting the, the tradition. That is so upsetting. But we did clear them out of the bamboo forest, which is just fantastic. This is fantastic. And we can now harvest bamboo stumps? Ooh. Miyako. Miyako. Oh, hello. You are much bigger than me. Wow. I can't tell if it's like a giant or if I'm just a very small child. <laughs> are you looking for your friend? Who are you? I'm just a humble admirer of the great Nico. Me too. I didn't think young people still cared about him. But you seem to be looking for someone else at the moment. There was a little girl running around, around out here not long ago. You saw Miyako? I don't know who that is, but this girl I saw was heading north. I'll mark the bus stop map with where I think she went. Thanks. Anything for another Nico aficionado. Ooh, thanks so much. Okay, so we have a bit of a lead on where Miyako is. I'm trying to see, is there... It's still a maze. Is there no temple or something? Because I thought... I, I have like Nico temple flowers, so I was thinking there might be a way to use those. But I don't... It doesn't appear that way. Okay, I'm just going to get some bamboo from the front of here and then I'm gonna go get paper and then yeah well that was exciting and tomorrow I guess we can go to the location where Miyako oh my god it's Bobo <laughs> what no Miyako there either how would you know that Bobo or should I say agent master let's see uh, no, but I saw a Nico follower. 
Nico follower? I haven't seen those folks around in ages. They're the keepers of the Nico temple. That Nico follower person thought she saw Miyako heading toward the Nico temple. Oh, so that's a separate location. Okay, that makes sense. You gotta go. I'll let you know what happens. Let me know. Good job, sidekick. He Saudis. Bobo really just takes... <laughs> just, he's like... He thinks he's doing everything and he hasn't even left the town in like... Weeks. But it's fine. It's fine. New theory. Bobo is hiding inside of Nico's body and possessing him. Well, in that case, Bobo is being very helpful and getting a bunch of resources. So I take it all back. But I, I doubt that because N Nico is way more helpful than Bobo has ever been. <laughs> okay. I gotta get a bunch of paper because we need some for the ramen shop. We need 50, I believe, for dad's ramen shop. And then we also need 25 for uh, the new villager that just moved in. So 75 altogether, I believe. If I'm recalling correctly. And... Yup. We only had like 10 pieces though, so we have a lot of chopping to do. <laughs> we now have 55. All right, perfect. Oh, that was a bad chop. That's my bad. And go. Perfect. And you. 73. Okay. If only I hadn't messed up, we would have it already, but that's okay. Okay. Mm hmm. All right. I think we have a good amount. That should be enough for the stuff that we need to do and also if we have stuff we want to craft before the night market because that is tomorrow. Um, yeah, because we wanted, we were making like the Sakura fans. So we probably are gonna need some paper for those. I just did that without even seeing. I feel like a god right now. <laughs> I'm a crap, I'm a, I'm a chopping god. Okay. Nice. Let us go to sleep. Wait. Hold on. Let's give dad the paper so that he can finally rest instead of standing over there. Father, hello. Here's your paper. Oh, it's so cute. And now he needs a sign, doesn't he? Here you go, kiddo. Sushi to go. We'll need a bunch of stuff for inside the restaurant, so let me know when you're ready to roll on the next task. And washi papers for the menus. Mmm. Dad is being so needy right now. <laughs> Donate your food. I think I donated the stuff I got last time. Not 100% sure. But yeah, we have to buy a bunch more stuff from the night market tomorrow. Ooh, I'm so excited. And time to sleep. Needy egg dad. You're not wrong. Okay. Okay. Nico has gotten us more sand. Here, have um go go get bamboo, please. I didn't really get that much. And I'm not sure what it's for, but I may need it. Oh, good grief. I only have enough for two washi paper. That's so... That's not enough for the menus. I should have had Nico get mulberry branches. I wasn't... I didn't know. <laughs> Dang it. Okay. What are we working with today? And bye, Lola. Thank you so much for hanging out. We'll let you know if Nico... Or if Bobo... Bo 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 Bo. <laughs> I almost said Boba. 
really want bubble tea, but I'll let you know. We'll let you know if he's evil. Unless you don't want to know. <laughs> but thank you. Whoa! How did you do that with simply wood and paper? You are amazing. Wow. I'm kind of amazed and impressed. So now you want a recycling box. Of course you do. Um... All right. So we do have the night market today, but I am going to first go to the Nico temple. We're going to see what's going on. We're going to see if Miyako's here. Nope. She is definitely here and looks a little dead. I'm not going to lie, which is kind of unfortunate. Miyako, are you good? It doesn't really look like you are. Miyako! Huh? Mineko? Is that you? You're alive! What day is it? Dude, you've been gone forever. Everyone's gonna be so relieved to see you. People remember that I'm gone? What are you talking about? Of course. Everyone's worried sick about you. Dude. No one was allowed to come look for you because the agents said, Those agents can suck on a lemon. It's their fault I'm out here to begin with. They chased me all the way out here and left me for dead. I know, I know. That's what they did to me, too. So I came out here to look for you. You were looking for me? Of course. Oh. Dude. Did you know that me and Bobo used to... I don't know. I guess we were kind of friends or something. Well, I guess he would say that I was more a former, former employee of his at the mystery team of kids who investigate... Whatever he called that stupid thing. We'd just run around the village assuming any random thing we came across was a clue that would lead us to Nico. Like one time... We saw this little puff of cotton drifting in the air, and we could swear that it was Nico's fur. So we just followed it and followed it for hours. One day we had this dumb fight over who was going to be in charge of our team, and we just... I don't know. Guess we always kind of butted heads about everything. That's just the way we were, you know? But for some reason, after this one... Oh, after this one, we kind of just stopped talking to each other. And then you showed up, and the two of you started going on adventures, and... I guess I just wanted to find Nico first. Sounds so stupid. He's probably not even real, but whatever. I guess I was a little jealous of you idiots. Well, okay. You're welcome to join us. That's cool of you to say, but for some reason, I'm guessing that's not everyone in your party is going to feel the same. Bobo is such a little brat. Oh my gosh. All this time I was worried about fitting in around here that I guess I never stopped to think of the people I might be excluding myself. I'm sorry we left you out. Thanks, Mineko. Anyways, I guess it'll be kind of cool. You and I will always be known as the two kids that the agents couldn't take down. Like superheroes. They'll call us like the super, the super not dying kids, the super invincible kids that can't, that the agents couldn't. The super sisters? Da, yes, the super sisters. Let's go punch something. <laughs> what? Okay. I'm going to get you home now, okay? Let's get the heck out of here, dude. Oh. No. <gasps> We got another heart. We got another heart. Bobo's agency is actually the agents. Guys, it's not looking good for, for dear Bobo. Miyako. Oh, Granny Fanny. Gran. Does she have Hank's tote bag on? No, it's just a regular one. I didn't mean to make everyone worry. I just got lost out there trying to... I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, everyone. I think we're all just glad you're okay. How are you feeling? Are you hurt? Are you ill? I'm okay, Gran. I'm okay. My poor Miyako. We're all so glad to see you home safe. Now everything's back to normal. Oh, shut up, Bobo. <laughs> I can go out again, Manex. Let's go. Hold on, Bobo. Why do you say I could go out when things are back to normal? There's obviously still danger out there. And until we find out what it is, it's for the best if you kids stick close to home for a little while longer. Now that's a smart lady. Dad. This is the longest grounding ever. You too, Miyako. Come on, Gran. I'm good to go, I swear. You gotta go. We'll be safe. Super safe. No. But if we... No. <laughs> oh, boy. Just, Bobo, just let it go. I'm gonna go home and prepare you a nice, warm Ojiya. I don't know what that is, but it sounds fantastic. Oh, I like Miyako now that she's back. 
This sucks. We already know what the danger is out there. It's those stupid agents in there. In there. Oh, hey, Miyako. Hey. Hey. <laughs> so, we're kind of having an official Bobo's Mystery Hunter Solver Dudes Inc. meeting. You need something? No, but when I was out there in the woods, I overheard those agents talking. Look, we already have a president and a secretary on the Mystery Hunter team. We're currently not accepting new applications. Bobo? Literally stop. Come on, Bobo. She might have some useful info. But can we really trust her on the team? I mean, who knows? Maybe she's a double agent and has been training with the agents in secret this entire time. She's like an 11-year-old girl. <laughs> oh my god. I have zero interest in being part of your mystery team, dude. But just shut up for a second and listen to me for once. What do you know? I overheard the agents talking a lot while I was out in the woods. I know they've set up some sort of HQ out in the abandoned building on the Northern Island. That's where their boss is directing the agents from. That's the base of their operations. If you're planning on stopping them, you're going to need to... Mount Fugu Island Daily! Eh? What's Mount Fugu Island Daily? It's the daily newspaper they used to have here. They used to have this one comic strip in there that... Teapot Man! What? What's Teapot Man? Oh my gosh. Okay, let's see. Bring me my tea! Bring it to me! That's Teapot Man, okay. Later, when we learned to read, we found out the comic actually sucked, so instead we kept making up our own. It feels like they should just be friends. They used to operate from the Northern Island. When the newspaper shut down, they didn't take the building with them. Oh, so that's where the HQ is. Won't be easy to get there. They've occupied the entire Northern Island and are expecting a new shipment of equipment coming any moment now. Dang. Looks like you're going to have to go to the Nico Temple and receive their blessing to cross into the Northern Island. Oh, okay. And Bobo's still grounded. Perfect. And Miyako can't leave, so it's all up to me. All right. Um, thank you. Fantastic team. Fantastic. I have to go. <laughs> Stop talking about the team, man. I have to go to the night market. Okay. Okay. Isn't it the night market? Am I nuts? Oh, I didn't craft anything. Oh, dang it. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. We're fine. Okay, I don't see any new food, which is a little disappointing, but it's fine. Now we have, due to the increasing popularity, we have a mascot! And a new store. Oh, that's... there. That might be the action figure that we need. <gasps> We're getting so much new stuff! And drinks? That's the creepy little milkman. I don't like them. Ooh, Dad's ramen! Oh, he's so precious. I love my dad. <laughs> New booth? Oh, and that's the degarbagenator or whatever. Welcome to the fourth night market of summer. This week's main event is the summer cat parade. My oh my. Make sure to stop by the stage. Okay, gotcha. I'm gonna hope that we have enough stuff to sell because I did not prepare very well for this. Um, well, we have these card games, which is good. Uh, hmm. Maybe some emeralds. I can I can put my my. Oh boy, <laughs> it's a rough going here for us. Um sell some of the duplicate boximals i could do that oh this is not great maybe if i sell some of my like i could sell the tiger's eye maybe uh-oh mm, sell the scalps do i even what do i have scalps i don't think i do maybe i'll sell a crab oh i should have i should have like crafted stuff i'm such a fool I have two of the fans. Uh, duh. Let's see. Crafted items. I only have these, but I need them for later, I think. So, um, here, I'll just put all 11 of the ramen and see if we have any takers for that. Uh, I have an octopus boximal. Maybe, maybe some gold. That's not very important. I'll put the diamond out. I don't know. Okay. Come on, everybody. Granny Fanny. Two emeralds. How about 224? Nice. We can still get a decent amount of money. 
two Sakura fans. How about 648? She's gonna say no. Okay, she said yes. Fantastic. Welcome, welcome. Four gold, 716. Uh, how about 700? Perfect. We're making a good amount of money. It's And it's all from Granny Fanny, who just wants all of our gems. And I'm not selling the diamond for that little. I'm sorry. Love you, Grant. Oh my god. <laughs> Granny! She really wants the diamond. Fine. Take it. Granny again! Okay. Take the tiger's eye. Please, can I have a new customer? Oh, thank gosh. Okay, two card games. 480... 425? Lovely. We need enough money to, like, buy all the new stuff. Oh my god, Granny. Granny! Granny! Just... Can I have another customer, please? Thank goodness. Okay. Please? That was everybody, and it was literally all Granny. <laughs> this is upsetting, but it's fine. Granny's your number one fan. I, I save her granddaughter once, and then suddenly she's the best customer. Okay, so this plush uh, pug we're definitely going to need at some point. I know that for certain because of the, the dog person. Mm, I don't see I don't see us needing those. I think we got all the fish we can from Koji, but I'm just gonna try anyway, just once. Manifesting a catfish boximal, you're so right. We need to buy a bunch of boximals and try and get the catfish. I don't know if the boximal tent is selling them. And we also have the de-garbage mifying machine, but we don't have garbage, so that sucks. Dad. Can I have... Whoa. You have so much ramen. I'm going to just buy one of them all so I can put them in the museum, even though this is my own dad. <laughs> and then this is new drinks. Heavy metal raisin brand shake. So fascinating. Okay. And then is this the yokai? Yeah, this is the yokai action figure. We need that for the, the one kid. And then I think the the other one the baseball guy is gonna want you know no family discount no my father does not care <laughs> he's just he's just in it for the money and whoa wait we actually need these white flowers wait that's kind of bonkers we actually need this i'm gonna get 20 and then i'm gonna get uh 20 of these okay beautiful thank you so much I'm not playing Octopole because I would like to live another day. <gasps> what is this? Hey, kid. Welcome to this, uh, booth. What are you selling? What are we selling? Muggsy, what are we selling? Uh, we're selling candy. We're selling candy. Yeah, one bona fide candy for sale. Did you just pull that out of your pocket? Move along, would you, kid? We're trying to do business over here. Hmm, so I should tell Bobo about the agents. There's so much going on. Oh, Bobo. I uh, hope you made lots of money to fund our adventures. Okay, I guess I have to tell him later. But let's get maybe five of these. Let's see what we get. Bobo already knows. Yeah, because he's the mastermind behind it all. And yeah, no, my dad never feeds me. Sometimes he does. Sometimes he's like, all I want is for people to be happy and well fed. And then he gives me like one sushi to go. I'm like... Have you had those trays of sushi? They're not very filling, father. And one a day? Good lord. Catfish? It's a raccoon. Okay, but the raccoon sells for a lot, so that's actually not bad. How about this one? It's a snail. But the snail also sells for a lot, so... Anything we can sell, I'm okay with. An octopus. Please give me a catfish. Okay. The catfish is like the rarest one, I'm pretty sure. Duh. I am a cat. Okay, let's buy some more. Let's buy some more. I know that I have a problem. I know that I have a problem. Don't mention it. Please don't mention it. I just really want the 
I just really want the catfish one. It'll be fine. Look how much money we still have. We can still buy like one, maybe two of the tables from Bobo's mom. Okay, five more. Catfish. That's an octopus. Told you 2k unboxables. Don't speak of it. Oh, tuna. No. Catfish. <gasps> catfish! 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 We actually got it. We actually got it. Oh my god, that's like the rarest one, I'm pretty sure. And then we got another jellyfish. I don't even care. <gasps> we did it! Oh, this is such good news. Ready to start the main event? Oh, we got the catfish! I'm gonna cry. And boxables are addictive. Wow! I wonder, is that the rarest, rarest one? Or is it just really rare? <gasps> I'm so excited. Okay, the moment we've all been waiting for. We've all made it to the main event of the night. Fish, yeah! Oh my gosh, you're right! Catfish, yeah! This is fantastic. I could cry. All right. The rest of the night market, all filler designed to waste your time until we can start the main event. Hesitant applause. I feel so fortunate to be accompanied by these incredible, amazing kids for tonight's parade. All right, let's go, team. We got a, a funky fish, yeah? Onward ho. Uh, left, right, and then enter his play. Right, 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 right. Onward we go. Bobo's not even playing his instrument. Why am I the only one playing as we go? All right, left. What is he training us for? I don't even know. Parade day is my favorite day. I love parade day. Left. It's so like awkward too. Like we're just standing here and he's like play. And then we're like, and then he's like left. And all the kids and the families are just watching us. And it's just me and Bobo and this cat. This random cat. Okay. But at least we have more stands that we get to look at. Agent training? I was literally thinking that. I was like, wow, is he training us to be secret agents? Is he perhaps the head honcho? Who knows? I love Bobo viciously playing the, the little guitar. Oh, my dad's ramen looks so good, though. Oh, my gosh. And all these little stands are so cute. I like the milk guy. He's very creepy, but I like him still. Oh. Right. Right. Oh, boy. Left. Head honcho because scalps. Danielle, now that you say that, that just feels like a joke that the the like writers of the dialogue in Maneko would make. And it just makes me even more suspicious about this guy. Hi, Dad. Look at me. I'm playing the recorder. Boop, 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 boop. Wait, weren't you just at the ramen stand? Am I making that up or was Dad also just at his ramen stand? <laughs> I don't remember anymore. Do, 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 tweedle, deedle, deedle, deedle. Here I go, doing the parade. Woo, do, 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 do. Oh. Playing away. Okay. We're like at the end, I'm so scared. Why suddenly a test? beautiful well done everybody well done well well now what did you think of that parade Woo! the crowd has spoken it was a massive hit great job kids was a cat part of the parade the entire time yes it was literally me bobo and a cat so i don't know how you <laughs> yeah you didn't notice that all right the trophy will be delivered to your home that is our last summer trophy this is so exciting and now it's like night night time like 
night night and oh my gosh i think that that's 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 the last day this is so sad i'm so upset now it's the autumn oh my gosh let's just go look outside okay we'll continue this for sure sometime in the next couple days but let's just go look outside let's see what the autumn looks like <gasps> whoa oh it's so pretty oh my gosh it's like breaking me it's so beautiful i love the autumn whoa the ambiance the vibes this is gonna oh this is amazing i love this game so much all i want to do is keep playing but I, I i must show restraint i didn't show restraint with the box moles, so i must show restraint <laughs> but yeah that's where we're gonna end off for today we'll come back and play more oh can i sit on this this is a fantastic game 10 out of 10 but yeah i'm gonna be playing some more of this for sure soon um i'm not exactly sure but like i said i'm gonna be doing a notification in my discord when i'm gonna be going live as i always do i'm gonna be playing more of this and more of like the new mario game and lots of other stuff that i'm very excited about um but i love this game and i can't wait to do the autumn and now we got the catfish box mold that we need to give it oh there's just so much to do so i'm very excited so thank you my my dear worm burgers i appreciate you being here and especially if you were at the first stream too I, I don't know how you're not tired of me but thank you so much and i'll see you guys next time peace outies my worm burgers goodbye